Three adults, two children, and multiple pets had to abandon their home today after a fire last night left it temporarily unlivable. 8 News reporter Alexis Bellamy was in the neighborhood where the fire happened and spoke to multiple neighbors. She brings us their reaction. And Alexis, what are people saying tonight? Well, Eric, Deanna, good evening. As some people were celebrating Independence Day just last night, Chesterfield Fire was responding to a house fire that had broken out in the Magnolia Green community. Now, when Chesterfield Fire did arrive, they found that the fire had gotten so out of control. I spoke to a neighbor earlier today who says that he saw the blaze grow and describes it as intense. Everyone was just having fun and uh you know, we have food and stuff like that on, you know, inside, and uh, it was just a regular, your basic Fourth of July. That was Badar Mahmood. He lives across the street from where last night's fire happened. He says when the holiday celebrations first started, he could have never predicted that he'd be calling 911 to report a house fire. As soon as I walked out <laughs> from this door at 1017, uh, I noticed there was a fire right in front of their garage, and uh, called 911 immediately. When Chesterfield firefighters arrived at the home in Magnolia Green, they were met with heavy fire coming from the garage. They say they were able to get the blaze under control just after 11 p.m. Mahmood describes seeing the flames in front of the house grow bigger by the second and praying for EMS to arrive. At first it was like up to like the hood of the car. And then as I was calling like the, the EMS and stuff, it kept getting like bigger and bigger. And it like suddenly like rose up to the to the roof of the house. I was afraid for I mean for the people in the house first of all. I mean I was afraid for them for everyone. I just didn't want like I just wanted the EMS to get here like right now. No one was hurt in the fire, but one firefighter suffered from heat exhaustion and was taken to the hospital and is expected to be okay. Mahmood and his family have lived in the Magnolia Green community for more than five years and say nothing like this has ever happened before. He says after he called 911, he got his mom and little sister out of harm's way. It was just me and my mom and my sister, so I made sure to get them because I was afraid because, you know, the cars are right in front of the, um, the garage and stuff, so I was afraid that the cars catch on fire and then, you know, causes a bigger fire and then it just, you know. And now other neighbors I spoke with today say that there were set, the neighborhood was setting off fireworks for hours last night. Some of those fireworks happening right in front of this house. Now earlier today we did reach out to Chesterfield Fire for an update for more information about this fire. They said they can't tell us exactly how it was started and that at this time they're unaware of the family's current living situation. We'll continue to keep you updated as updates become available. For now reporting live in Chesterfield, Alexis Bellamy, 8 News.